Isidore Rabi is now 85 years old, a Nobel Prize winner. He came back to Los Alamos this spring for the laboratory's 40th anniversary. He came to speak to a new generation of scientists. What goes through your mind now when you come back? Uh, sorrow that the place still exists. You didn't expect it to be here this long? Uh, certainly not. It's all extraordinary. Many of the first Los Alamos scientists thought atomic weapons would be banned after the war. They had, after all, been present at creation. I remember what I thought. That's uh, it's an, it's something you don't forget, something which changes your life and outlook. It becomes visceral. I got goose flesh, really. Goose flesh? Yes. That's uh, Literally? Literally, goose flesh. After the first few minutes of elation, you know, can realize what had happened to the, to the world. And this has determined my subsequent career. To, the big thing I felt was to eliminate this. From then from on the that? World. From then on, that was my interest. I, uh, I uh, way overestimated the wisdom of the politicians. Well, there it is now. Did you ever think it would be this big? It's an abomination. <laughs> an abomination. We should have put that thing to rest 30 years ago at least. We didn't, and the arms race has flourished. So does Los Alamos all these years later. <laughs>